Mashhad city northeast of Iran is where the eighth Shiite Imam lays to rest. In addition to being a holy site for the Muslim community, Imam Reza's shrine has also turned into a major tourist attraction. The beautiful architecture to the rich libraries and museums surrounding it are all precious sights to see. This next feature will tell you about the Astana Quds Razavi Museum. Astana Quds Razavi Museum is one of the spectacular parts of the Astana Quds Razavi complex. The museum hosts many ancient items that illustrate the history of Mashhad. The abundance of these items is because of the significance that Shiite Muslims have always attached to this religious city. After the extension of the Holy Shrine, these works were gradually transferred to Astana Quds Museum and thus made up one of the most invaluable collections of religious items in the Muslim world. One of the most significant works in this museum is the oldest tombstone on the holy grave of Imam Reza, which has been carved with delicate patterns from white marble stone. The inscriptions on the stone include one Kufic script in the middle that outlines a mihrab and two Kufic scripts on the brinks. There are gold tablets on which Thoth and Nastaliq scripts have been inscripted by the renowned calligraphist Ali Reza Abbasi. There are also works of other renowned calligraphists in some other corners of the museum. The ancient locks that are kept in the museum catch the eyes of every visitor. An old steel zari that dates back to the Qajar dynasty era and another one that was recently changed are kept in this museum. Big canvases that were used by storytellers known as naqal are also on display in the museum. One of the exquisite objects exhibited in the museum is a magnificent manbar or rostrum that has been decorated with inlaid marquetry. It's over one and a half meter high and was made in the early 20th century. Among the current objects in the museum, there are sport medals of deceased world wrestling champion Qolam Reza Takhti and other athletes and also medals and awards won by Iranian scholars in international scientific competitions. They are all offered to the museum as gifts to pay respect to Imam Reza. Some of the famous paintings by Iranian master Kamal al-Mulk and contemporary artist Ostad Mahmoud Farsh Chian have been put on display in this museum. There is a section on the second floor of the museum which has been dedicated to astronomy. It contains ancient astronomy instruments and old clocks that have been mostly presented as gifts to the museum. Another significant section in the museum is the Shell Museum that hosts over 1,300 noteworthy splendid seashells and snail shells. The collection of Qur'an manuscripts is one of the valuable sections of Astana Quds Razavi complex, which is situated next to the Central Museum. The manuscripts are believed to have been written by five Imams of the Shi'i faith and are some of the most unique and precious works in this museum. Overall, above a hundred copies of the Holy Book are kept here, including some with jewel-studded covers. There are also several pages of the Quran written by Baison Ghor, a prominent calligrapher in Muhaqqaq script. 
These have already created a unique and priceless collection in this museum. And that's a wrap for this edition. You can keep in touch with the Iran team and let us know what you'd like to learn about Iran. Iran at PressTV.ir is where you can send us an email. Plus, you can check out our Facebook page, Iran Program Press TV. Leave your comments there and you can be in touch with our reporters. And I speak for all when I say we'd love to hear from you. For all of us here in Iran, Khodanegahdah.